my yard show. <laughs> yep, that's right, it's mowing season. Man's gonna be wondering, how does it get a yard like that? Well, I got five easy steps here. I'm gonna teach you here on how to have a yard like this right here. You might be saying, well, that guy don't know a lick about mowing the yard. I sure do. I tell you what, I've been watching a bunch of YouTube videos. Old Pete down there, North Carolina, has been teaching me a whole lot about how to mow a yard. And I'm going to share you some of the things I've been learning. All right, let's get to it. Here we go. Step number one. You got to have the right kind of equipment. Now listen, it don't matter what kind of yard you got. You got the right kind of equipment. You can take this kind of yard into this kind of yard. Would you look at that? Listen, you get the right kind of equipment, boy, you can make things look good. All right, now, folks, step two. Tell you what, uh, this is one of the most important ones. Safety first. Hey, wait a minute. If safety is first, shouldn't safety first be step number one? You got it wrong, Doug. Do what? Safety first is first. Huh? Hey, I can't hear you. You got it wrong. <laughs> I have no idea what they're saying. Anyway, folks, safety first. You do the math. I can't figure it up. But safety should be first. I tell you what, these things are getting hot. Say I'm what? going inside. Oh, now I can hear you. <laughs> uh, step three here. This right here is what I call my kung fu chop. <laughs> I tell you why. You get up there next to them weeds, boy, this thing just chops them weeds right to pieces. I tell you what. But, uh, don't matter what kind of grass you got, if you got fescue, don't matter if you got bluegrass or more fescue, rye grass, or uh, green grass, or whatever you got there. Uh, this thing right here will come right through it. <laughs> now, here, I'll tell you what, one thing you gotta watch out for here. Don't stick your teeth on these. Uh, one time a man was out there, he's out there kung fu in his grass, and uh, these little sticks got here, got hung there, and, well, he he thought he'd grab a hold up with his mouth, and uh, folks, I just wouldn't recommend that. All right, uh, this is step number four. Oh wait, folks, one thing I forgot to remember: that's safety first. Remember, it's on the second step, but it should be on the first step. So I need to change real quick here, because I can't mow this. I know it look good, but I need to mow something a little different. Here's my pants, here we go. All right, here we go. And pow! Well, folks, it's time to show you a little action here on that, all right? Let's get going here. We talked about having good equipment. This thing right here has made all the difference in the world. After I sold my goat, I felt like I needed to make a more of an investment in my yard here. I bought this thing off of my cousin, John Deere, and uh, I've done some modifications on it, and I'll show you around the back here what I mean. And I like to call this thing Doug Deer. It, uh, it gets the job done, folks. I tell you what, you can spend a lot of money on these things. But you get something like this right here, and uh, you just kind of whip it like that. Just kind of whip it. And uh, when you whip it like that, I tell you what, you can get a lot of yard mowing and quick. Not only does it mow it quick, but look here. When you whip it like that, boy, it gets it nice and smooth there. Now, don't forget, we ain't trying to play golf out here. This is our yard. So don't mow it down like you're mowing your hair. All right, folks? We want to 
keep it nice and lush, nice and green there for the years to come, months to come. All right, here today I got with me, I got old Joe Buck. I got Daisy May. And I got Peanut there on the end there. We're going to show you how to do step number five. One of my favorite steps of all time. We got this right here. This thing's called the Daggum 5000. And you might be wondering, why you call it the Daggum 5000? Well, when we fire it up, you'll be saying, Daggum, I tell you what. It'll blow the ugly plum right off your face right there on that. All right, here, I'll tell you what, we're going to fire it up here and have a little fun with it, all right? They all like this part when I get it out here. Here we go. Ha! I asked him her down there, little dog. <laughs> Something like that right there, you get it. I gotta ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Why you got your mask on? So the rats don't get in my eyes. That's a pretty good idea. Don't want the grass getting his eyes. <laughs> Boy, it sure is good to have Joe Buck, Daisy May, and Peanut back with us. <laughs> it's just in time for supper. I reckon they went on a little world traveling tour. <laughs> but anyway, nothing like coming to the end of the day and being able to enjoy what you ate, what you worked hard for all day. And that's a beautiful yard like that right there. And don't forget, we're professionals. You might not always get the same results like that right there. If you liked our video today, be sure to click subscribe. Don't forget to like it. For something you'd like to learn, just right down there on the comments somewhere down there in there on that. And we might try it out. All right, signing off. We'll see you later. Bye-bye, everybody.